السلام علیکم آئی ایم طاہر حسین فرام فیز اینڈ انٹرنیشنل پرائیویٹ لمیٹڈ ان دس ویڈیو آئی ول ایکسپلین واٹ از سی جی ایم پی ان دا فارماسیوٹیکل انڈسٹری مائی مین کنسرن ٹو ایکسپلین ایچ یو سی سسٹم ان فارماسیوٹیکل بٹ فرسٹ وی ول سی واٹ از سی جی ایم پی سی جی ایم پی از اے ایبریویشن آف کرنٹ گڈس مینوفیکچرنگ پریکٹس آل دی کنٹریز ہیو دیئر اون سی جی ایم پی rules, regulation and guidelines. CGMP actually it is set of rules, regulation, guideline for construction of manufacturing facilities, manufacturing process and cleanliness. CGMP have rules and regulation like construction of pharmaceutical building, type of machines to be used, HVAC system, types of walls, types of flooring, type of ceiling, type of garments used in production area, dust collection system in the pharmaceutical industry, all these rules, regulation and guidelines are used in CGMP. Every pharmaceutical industry has to follow these rules and the regulation. Now I will discuss especially role of HVAC system in this CGMP. HVAC system in pharmaceutical industry, there are four rules need to be implemented in pharmaceutical industry. First, control airborne particles, dust and microorganism through air filtration using high efficiency particulate, air HIPAA filters, pre-filter and fine filters. Second is maintain room pressure, positive or negative. Third is maintain humidity by humidifier or dehumidifiers. The fourth one is maintain and achieve space temperature. So now I will explain all of these rules one by one. The first rule is to filter the air which we are supplying in the production area. In this case, we control airborne particles, dust and microorganism through air filtration using high efficiency particulate air HIPAA filters, pre-filters and fine filters. Pre-filter like coarse filter, coarse filter having class G3, G4 can hold dust particle size bigger than 10 microns like insects, textile fibers, hairs, sand, fly ash, spores, pollen and semen dust. It is installed in the AHU as a pre-filter. The next is fine filter are designed to arrest fine particle up to 1 to 10 microns. It is normally used as a scandal filter after pre-filter to have a prolonged service life like pollen, spores, semen dust, fly ash, bacteria and germs on host particle. Fine filter having class M5. After fine filters, we use HIPAA filter which can be used inside the AHU, inside duct or inside production area, ceiling or walls. HIPAA filter are designed to arrest very fine particles, 99.97% of particles that are 0.3 microns. Second rule to maintain room pressure. For maintaining room cleanliness in the production area, it's very important to maintain the room pressure. In CGMP, pressure of each room area has described that this area should be positive pressure and this area have negative pressure. So, positive pressure maintained in the area by supplying more air as compared to return air. So, due to more air supplying, positive pressure is generating that area. So, like this way, we are maintaining some area positive pressure and some area negative pressure. So, there will be no contamination of products from one area to another area. Our third rule is to maintain humidity of air by cooling below dew point or by using dehumidifiers. There are two types of dehumidifiers, refrigerant type and desiccant type. Desiccant type dehumidifiers are very economical as compared to refrigerant type. Almost all products need humidity for maintaining the sterility. If proper humidity is not maintaining in the production area, product will be bad quality. Last rule is maintain space temperature. Almost all products need specified temperature of their stability. If the proper temperature is not maintained in the production area, product stability will decrease. So it will reflect bad quality on the product. So it is very important to maintain the proper temperature in the production area. This video has finished and we will discuss uh, in our next video the dust control system in the pharmaceutical industry. Thanks and best regards for watching this video.